You're like, oh, I forgot to eat the gum. This and I'm, is the I'm most not, important part. I and you weren't even going to do it on camera, but I, now I'm like, I'm Let's turning it back on. That's Morgan hilarious. Morgan Mindy gum from, let me make sure, 1978. Mmm, I don't. I've heard Chalky on some of the early gum. Oh, I've no, it's delicious. <laughs> it's got to be the worst thing in the world. It's 70, it's like, it's almost 50 years old. It's four. It's turning more into a pixie stick. Oh, yeah. You're not stealing if you let us know, though. Okay, great. I don't think it's going to become gum. No, it's just going to dissolve. For Simeon Goodson, it just dissolved in his mouth. Uh, I hope I, 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 I absorb some of Robin's essence. For the, yeah, uh, he didn't eat the gum. I didn't get him in time. Yeah. <laughs> you know? If not if kind of a mothball thing? Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. There's but logic to that. I wouldn't regret it. Maybe it's filled with those nitrogens. Don't Boom. Well with that. All right. <laughs> Thanks, Thanks so Dave. Much. It's Comedians Opening Cards, No Coffee, and we're in Laconia, and I think it's Wednesday? It is Wednesday. And this is like, uh, what's this place called? This is Define Records and Craft Beer. It's awesome. And what's your name? I am Redbeard. I'm a stand-up comedian. And how long have you been doing comedy? I've been doing comedy for like two years, seriously, I'd say, regularly. Right, right, right. And how do you like the scene in this, uh, in Laconia, New Hampshire? Honestly, it was a pleasant surprise that we even have comedy available. Right, 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 right. I was always going towards major cities like uh, Boston and New York. Right. For comedy, I didn't, I wouldn't have imagined it was in many places in New Hampshire. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When I moved to the Lakes region, it was, we were having three a night. Uh, yeah, yeah. Three a week, excuse me. Since November, what's up, Ed? Um, and, uh... Well, it's popping up everywhere. It's the biggest time ever com for comedy. So, if you want to do it, now's the time. Yeah, Without it's a, a comedy boom. I'm well aware of it. I'm doing it. I'm right. Fine. Exactly. You gotta, you gotta just keep going out and doing it. I mean, it's fun just to do right. response or not. Right, right, right. If you're a comedian, you just go out and do it. Right, right. Go, go see live comedy. Out. Hey, so we got all these cards, so just pick a pack and then talk about it for as long or as short as you want, and then I'll have you sign one card, and then you keep the others if you so desire. Oh, crap. So something that, you know, you read, I, I almost want to pick something I don't know. Sure, yeah. For the mystery of it, that's that's the that's the magic of buying Red dude is an interesting one that's been picked twice. It's rat pretty dudes. fun. Yeah, it's, I feel like I'm a rat dude. Yeah, yeah, it's, it, you never, you know, Morgan you don't know. Mindy sounds like, there's a, Bubble gum from 1978 in here. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Mark Norman's eating the gum. Uh, Josh oh, Adam Myers is eating I, the gum. Uh, a lot, a a lot, lot of open mics. Mark Norman ate the gum. Well, he I didn't think. eat it from this one. He ate it from. He did Growing Pains. He did this. You know, he did a Growing Pains pack, and it was. You know, Ooh. it's crazy. I'm not saying. Which would you think uh, tastes better, Three's Company or or Mark and Mindy? I've. <laughs> I've seen I, no one. I, no one's tasted Mork and Mindy's gum. Three's Company uh, guy in Vermont. I can't think of his name. He spit it out, but people have spit out the gum. Some people have swallowed it. I don't know. I don't recommend it gum eating, and I take no responsibility. I, in honor of Robin Williams, one of the best comics of all time, I'm yes. gonna pick Mork and Mindy. Awesome. I think Godfrey opened uh, a Mork and Mindy. Godfrey. And he did, or and he did sound effects and stuff. It was, I mean, he did the songs of stuff, you know. Oh, you know, it was amazing. I also, they got Mork and Mindy, Mork for Mork, with uh, Pam Dauber. Yes. Pam Dauber, Mork and Mindy, and it was Robin Williams, uh, his big first big sitcom, you know. And I love Robin Williams. And that came out of Happy Days. Yeah, it came. He was right. He was a character out of Happy Days when he froze the Fonz. Remember, he couldn't do anything with the Fonz, and then he got his own sitcom. And guess what? Me and him have the same birthday, July 21st. David Tell. Robin wow. Williams. July 21st. <laughs> <laughs> I told him, Gabe Kaplan, welcome back. I made a mistake about uh, all the, the impressions I was great at are of other cultures, which doesn't go over well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you kind, you're too old. You're, yeah, it's too late <laughs> like, for those in like, a way. Yeah, I'll just drop those. Maybe it'll come back. We'll see. I don't know. We'll see. 
All right. I don't even know what these are supposed to be about. I wish. Yeah. Let me find one with Robin on it. There okay. You go. This one says, Mindy, I'd like to take you to a restaurant with lots of atmosphere and nitrogen. <laughs> Awesome. Oh, yeah, yeah, I think, don't we have a lot of nitrogen here? Isn't most of In our... In the atmosphere? Yeah, isn't our air more nitrogen than I mean, oxygen? I, I know, think it's like 78% I know nitrogen. The kids certainly like cracking those little cartridges of the nitrogens. It's all the rage with the balloons at the festivals. Oh, yeah. Well, the balloons, <laughs> the only thing I know is that's the, uh, what is that? Uh, nitric oxide. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. That's yeah, nitric... Yeah. I see what you're saying. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So am I? I'm autographing a Robin. Yeah. Card? So That's you what's just go. Yeah. You, you you sign whatever you want and. Uh... All right. This is Redbeard going on to Robin Williams in a. I don't know if this is a spacesuit or he's. Yeah, that's his outfit from uh, Mork calling Orson. He was. Uh, I can't remember the this orc was it was that the name of the planet? I can't remember. You know when he went in to do the job, when he what's it called when you go in and like hey we'll see if you're any good. Audition. Audition. He came in go. and sat upside down on the seat, which they then used as a thing. But because he did that, that's one of the reasons he got the show. Is because he came in. And like, yeah. yeah. And the alien would come in upside down. No one else did that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So. That's awesome. Yeah, yeah. Awesome. Well, hey, go see live comedy because that's where it's happening. It's comedians opening cards, no coffee, and we're still at that brewery. What was this thing called? Defiant Records and Craft Beers. Defiant Records and Craft Beers in Laconia, New Hampshire. And who do I got now? My name's Matt Wilson. Awesome. And how long have you been doing comedy? About a year now. Sweet. And how do you like the scene? I like it down here. It's a lot of fun. Yeah, yeah. yeah. There are a lot of mics around in New Hampshire. Uh, they had a few others, but uh, we have to travel for them now. This is the one that's cool for now in this area. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, Sweet. This is, this is the spot to be, I think. All right, so we got a lot of cards. Uh, I don't know if you've seen anything that interests you, but... Uh... Yeah, absolutely. New Kids on the Block. Oh, sweet! I saw them in concert uh, last summer. In, in oh, Boston. they're still going? You wouldn't believe how crazy Boston goes for New Kids on the Block. Really? Every person in the hotel we were at was there to see New Kids on the Block. Are I was one of the five guys that was in the, in the garden. It's all, all middle-aged oh. girls. Oh, is that why? <laughs> <laughs> My girlfriend didn't want to leave me in the lobby of the hotel. Right, right, right. Understandable. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. So, are, are some of them from the Boston They're area? From Boston, yeah. So that's yeah. why then. Yeah. That makes perfect sense. Everybody okay. in Boston has a story about New Kids on the Block going up. Gotcha, they gotcha, gotcha. Dance, class, cor church, chorus. Oh, and then yeah, yeah, everyone yeah. from down there knows them. Right, right, right. Or, or pretends to know them. Or has a cousin that knows them. Right, 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 right. Adrian Iappalucci opened a pack of these. I think her special is going to drop sometime this year. And I think Ari Shafir is producing it. And uh, maybe. Uh, Louis C.K. might have something to do with it. I don't know. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. But she opened this pack. Yeah, yeah. Was my yeah, yeah. Well, not this one, but that I, a pack hey. of those. So what do you got? Buying a drink tonight, right? Yes. All right. All right, man. We got we got Joey McIntyre. You gotta show him this way so I can. Uh, you can open them later if you're if you're a comic. We got Joey McIntyre here. He's the lady's favorite, I believe. Oh, nice. Sometimes there's one that's a, a sticker. Oh, same person. Yeah, of course. It's both Joey McIntyre. I don't know. I can't really see that great. Yeah, this is a sticker. See how it says peel? Ah, very nice. So you can put that, you can put Joe on something. Or Joe E. Awesome. Here's all of them. Donnie's got no shoes on. Very, very sexy Donnie. Oh, wow. Yeah. That could go on. Isn't there some way where there's like feet or something? I, that I don't know. I, I've heard that there I, is. I know that a lot of these guys were that, at the Celtics game. That chased game. the girl away. <laughs> <laughs> I know a lot of these guys were at the Celtics game last night watching them kick ass in overtime. Last night? Yes, sir. Wow. That good 80s fashion there. Are they coming down for that? Oh, that's not yet. That, oh, there's an, is next weekend there's some big Boston festival music thing or something. They don't come to that, do they? Like I, I don't know. I'm going to see the Rolling Stones in Boston about two weeks from now. Oh my god. Yeah, it's 80 like 80? years old. <laughs> yeah. I think Mick Jagger's actually in a hospital bed with an IV in his Until arm. he gets up. <laughs> At this point, yeah, still he gets his hair with well, whatever he, he needs. runs around. I don't, I mean, yeah, he yeah, just he's energetic. Doing. Here's them that's in Boston, right outside oh, of Dorchester. black and white. Yeah, right next to Methadone Mile, they call it. Oh. Yeah, you go through Methadone Mile, and they have a world class zoo right after. On your way through, you would have believed. The Franklin Zoo? Uh, no. Yeah, the Franklin Park Zoo. Franklin Park Zoo, it, it yeah, yeah. It's in the middle of the ghetto. The place is Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gorgeous. I've been to that. I've been to the yeah. Franklin Park Zoo. Yeah. We were driving yeah. through it with my daughter, and she's like, is there really a zoo in this neighborhood? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I don't know. That guy's sleeping on the side. There was a very right. sad, uh, some sort of animal in there. It was all by itself, and it was doing that pacing thing. It was like a big cat, and you're like, oh, oh God, this is terrible. All right, well, there's another car to the new kids. These are definitely coming to my work to show off to the customers. <laughs> so there's Jordan Knight. You can see 
Awesome, yeah. You. you just sign one and then you can keep the others if you so desire. And it sounds like you want them because they're, you know, most people keep them. Absolutely, yeah. yeah. Sign the back of them. It's, it's, there's no rules. Awesome. This looks like it's going to be a pretty good uh, turnout here. I hope so. Yeah. There we go. Awesome. Well, thanks so much for doing the show. Thank and you. Uh, My pleasure. Go see live comedy because it's happening.